up my computer here. <laughs> you can see I only have 3 gigs left on my hard drive and I'm even recording to it. This is an issue. We can right click it and look at properties and we can see how many gigabytes are in the uh, downloads folder. So we're going to it and I've checked all these files now so I can mark them all and just hold shift and click delete. Uh, in this they will not cycle through the recycle bin and just get deleted instantly. There we go, 1.7 gigs free. Open up the recycle bin and uh, check through the files here if there is anything you want to keep. And if there is not, you'll just hold control, click A and then click delete. And you will permanently delete these files. And now we can see we have uh, 21 gigabytes free. Fantastic! <laughs> Now we will run disk cleanup. To do this, hover over your C drive, right click on it, select properties, and then you'll select disk cleanup here. Inside the disk cleanup, we should check this thing. Clean up system files, and it will check the system for a couple of minutes. And here you can see Windows Update Cleanup. We can check this. We can also remove junk from Microsoft Defender that's no longer needed. And Windows Update Log Files. Downloaded program files and temporary internet files. We can check them as well. Windows Error Reports, DirectX Shader Cage, and Delivery Optimization Files. The stuff you find here is files that are not needed. So, you can basically go and check all these files. Inside of here, you may also empty the recycle bin if you haven't already done so. We can also clean up some temporary files. So basically, all of these files here can be removed. They are no longer needed. But you might not be able to upgrade to uh, or downgrade your previous version of Windows. But you can just check all these here and select OK and you will be able to clean them up. Very nice. And we'll be able to get back 6 gigabytes from this. Are you sure? Uh, yes we are. And there we freed up some space. So you can do this on the other drives. And we can see for this drive there is nothing to clean up. And let's select our F drive, this clean up. Nothing there either. And there we go. Now we cleaned up or checked all the drives. Uh, with this cleanup tool. Very useful. There is this fantastically useful application called Windirstat. It gives a visual representation of how big the files are by showing them as color clusters. So download this application and install it. It's free from ads as well and just um, select a drive you want to index and click OK. Now uh, indexing this will take a little bit of time so just wait for it. Great we're done scanning and if you want to know what big files are here well you can just uh, click on a big file and you can see here uh, it's satisfactory. A game I have installed that's big and if I don't want it, this game anymore I know okay I need to uninstall this game to get the 10 gigabytes free. Fantastic. And what do we have here? A hibernation file. Uh, if you don't use hibernation you should turn it off but I think it's a super useful feature and I gladly spend 6 gigs on it. What is this for an enormous file? Well it's an old recording and oh my god it's 37 gig. Glad I found it so easily and I can delete this one as well. And I can delete this file. Permanently. Fantastic. And now it uh, recalculates and give you the new space. So here we have, oh, I have my already done videos. Uh, well, I can move those videos to uh, a new file location, uh, like for my backup drive, for example. So, um, you know, this and this, it should give free up to 10 gigs for me. So I'll move them to my archive drive instead. And there we go, now we have 70 gigs free. Fantastic! Hope we did clean up some stuff there, and if it did, please leave a like and do subscribe for future videos. This is your host, Jim Edison, signing out.